Why do we have a pasta maker? That's not for this. Hi, it's me, William Osmond. Today we're making an angle grinder cotton candy machine in my friend Cedric's house because we're going to Maker Faire, staying up here at San Jose. We're going to try to bring cotton candy machine to Maker Faire if they let us hit him with a blowtorch and an angle grinder machine strapped candy melter device. Did I nail it? That's awesome. I sort of just say the first thing that comes into my head. Usually it's not coherent. We did a bunch of research. We just watched videos on YouTube. A little metal container with pinholes on the side and you put it on a motor you heat it up and it spins and it literally just sprays out hot melted sugar. I really want to try to bring this to Maker Faire. If we can like make Cotton Candy Fair, cotton, oh my god, Cotton Candy at Maker Faire for, uh, for people, I think that would be really fun. I don't think they'll let us in with this though. So then we have to get that like super centered. Super centered. But make the hole a little bit bigger and then we can always scoot it around and tighten it down. Okay, that's right a good place. idea. It's not even... Your Harbor Freight calipers are now pliers too. <laughs> Let's put that on. We're definitely gonna coat your Makita in yeah. candy. Yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it. This is William Osmond channel. We're, we're quick to pull the trigger. What's the worst that could happen? Okay. I'd say that it's really well centered. How do we do such a good job? I apologize for this amazing cotton candy machine. I wanna tighten it even more. Do you not trust it? No. We found a coffee filter that maybe will work. It's got really, really tiny holes in it. We've cut the, the bottom of the mesh flat and it fits like nicely into that groove. Fold it over the top or something and then put the lid on top of it. Is that a real person? Yeah. Is that a woman? Is that a man? Beep, beep. Is that, are you serious? That's a real no, person. I, I could turn the damn thing on. Oh! Whoa! Do it again, do it again! Whoa! Oh my god! Oh, it's so much more. I've never seen anything finer. That worked incredibly well. Not even her craftsmanship. <laughs> I, can't tell. I can't tell if you're making fun of us or. I can't wait to get some hot lava sugar. <laughs> Step one, cut a hole in the box. Step two, put your angle grinder in the box. And we poked a hole in the side for the torch and we're gonna pour some table sugar in and see what happens. This, this is flammable, isn't, isn't it? With the box? Yeah. And the sugar. What you wanna do is make sure that the bottle itself doesn't go inverted because then liquid propane will come out. Stop vibrating. Yeah. That's because they're like balancing stuff. Oh god! That's a filter. Uh, it didn't melt at all. It didn't melt. That was really loud. Oh, it was too much weight. Too much sugar? Too much weight. How hot is it? It's like not hot at all. We need a better heat source. What if we pour like pre-molten sugar in Well, that's it? what everybody else does. Really? Yeah. It cheating? would definitely work. And it is kind of cheating. Oh! <laughs> Did it launch the, look at that! Okay, it worked. What, what flung out? Oh, that was the tape. Really? Yeah. Press more? Yeah, go more. Okay, right, stop. Stop. We lost the filter again. That's cotton candy. That's color. Ooh, it's like caramel too. Yeah. Oh, hello. Would you like to taste my mouth? Ooh. I, I was gonna eat that. <laughs> kind of feels like I'm eating like spider webs or like insulation. Like fiberglass yeah, insulation. insulation. Are we gonna have time to do another version two, like yeah. tonight? What time does Maker first start? Like 10? In the morning? Yeah. We can get We're currently in a, in a tiny basement. Is this a basement? What do you call this? Like a big crawl space? Not a basement, not a crawl space. But uh, what you're saying is if I fart, the stench will stay in here for days. <laughs> I'm sorry. So the second version is just a tuna can with a bunch of holes drilled in it. So it smells like tuna. <laughs> That's it? Yeah, it smells. <laughs> 
God. Hey, Cedric. Hey. You come here a lot? Care man chance too short. <laughs> Can we please start small? Hi, Aaron. A night creature appears. What do you think we're doing right now? Really, it was scary. <laughs> just, that was really scary. I'm glad I didn't. Could have been really bad. I'm glad I didn't. Is that a can of tuna? <laughs> it used to be. You know where our house smells really bad. Yeah. So what? Ha what? What happened? Here at Maker Fair, we make some cotton candy. We found some suspecting fans that I previously had never met before. I swear, I don't know them, and uh, we're gonna make them some cotton candy with our, with this, an angle grinder. You guys ready? Oh dear. <laughs> Kid, you wanna buy some smack? <laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> this is like the lowest point of my life. <laughs> oh, this is gonna work so well, dude. You know this is gonna work great well. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, turn it off. I can't believe it. All right, I hope you guys are hungry. Reach. <laughs> Did you you actually made cotton candy? Yeah, we just made. Can I feed it to one of you? <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> wow. It looks like fiberglass. <laughs> I think it is fiberglass. <laughs> you get a big piece. We need to make a lot more of this. Stuff. Oh, this is really good. This is actually pretty good. Oh man. It's yeah, we're gonna. That is way better than I expected. Yo, yo, I wanna get. That's, that's almost, it's cotton candy, don't worry. That's what the kids call it these days. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, let's make more. Okay. Anybody else have a crack spoon? This is like the, <laughs> this is like the underground maker fair. You want some cotton candy? Yeah, bro. We're making angle grinder cotton candy. I think you're cooking heroin, Sounds bad. I think it's spraying out. I think our holes are too big. Do we put too much or the hole's too big? No, the holes are still empty. It looks like, it looks like a squirrel that got stuck in someone's bike tire. <laughs> Sugar high! The minions meeting. You know, honestly, I've never gotten this far before. Yeah. All right, turn it off. All right, Leo, you want some candy? Take your finger. You're not bribes, they're gifts. You want some cotton candy? Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Reach for it. And handing it out to the crowd, too. That's right. Don't touch the metal. If you want some candy, reach in and grab some. Vote on the Moxie board. Go, Pete. A one out of ten. What's that sucker worth to you? We gotta make some more, dude. Six. Yeah. All right, Leo. You get a big piece. Oh. A 10, 6, 10, and... You can't watch and then not eat it. Of course. That's awesome. 6. There you go. Looks like, looks like fiberglass. It tastes like candy. Is it really just straight up sugar? It's straight sugar, yeah. And then we heat it in what looks like a crack torch. Unbalanced and ready to explode like the tuna can did. <laughs> no more risks. And we made enough. I think we made like three or four batches, so I think we'll call it quits. It's part of Bye. It's giveaway time. This time for our Patreons because they gave us way more money than we deserve. But the money we need, not the money we need. Okay, whatever. We're giving away a t shirt, a cat, laser cut cat t shirt, a wooden skateboard and the sunglasses off my own face. Thanks, guys. Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> like sticking out now.
All right, let's never do that again.